Hello, let's do another news lesson. This time it's about bear meat. <laughs> Sorry, I'm having too much fun. Let's look at the uh, lesson and please repeat the title. A town in Japan sells bear meat from a vending machine. <laughs> Japanese vending machines are the best. Uh, okay, please repeat the words at the top. Vulnerable. Vulnerable. Immediately. Immediately. Traps. Insects. Rural. Drained. Okay, now we need to match those words with endangered, countryside, bugs, emptied, right away, and snares. Snares. Okay, let's let's see. I've got my pen. Um vulnerable. Vulnerable, maybe that's a new word for you. Uh vulnerable means endangered okay it means you are you can you you are weak right not strong you are weak and in danger immediately do your homework immediately <laughs> which means right away do it now straight away right away Traps. So traps, uh, a trap is another word for a snare, which is an animal trap in the, usually in the mountains, you know, maybe like a ka-ching, ka-ching. <laughs> That's a snare. Very painful. All right, uh, next one. Insects. Insects means bugs. Whoop, whoop. Okay, I don't like bugs or insects. Rural, rural, that, that comes from uh, countryside, right? If you live in, in a rural area, you live in the countryside. And the last one, drained. Drained means uh, emptied, but emptied of a, a liquid, like emptied of water. Um, okay, right, please remember those words, vulnerable, vulnerable, vulnerable. And let's try the article. Please shadow my voice, a uh, uh, town town in, in Japan, Japan. Three, two, one, go. A town in Japan has started selling bear meat from a vending machine. The meat comes from Asian black bears that are caught in traps or in the mountains by hunters. The bears come into town to find food because there is not enough in the forests. This is causing more bear attacks in rural Japan. Mm -hmm. Daishi Sato put the vending machine outside his noodle shop in Semboku in Akita Prefecture. Asian black bears are listed as vulnerable, but it is legal to eat bear in Japan. Meat from trapped bears is tastier because the blood is drained immediately. Ooh. Last one. Uh, vending machines in Japan sell many things, including drinks, snacks, surgical masks, edible insects, and whale meat. Uh, Sato wants tourists to buy the bear meat because it is not very common. He sells 7 to 10 packs of 250 grams each week for 2,200 yen each. Mm. Last year, 75 people were hurt by bears in Japan and two were killed, including one in Akita. 
Ah. I, I have never seen edible insects in a Japanese vending machine, not yet. And I, I've never seen whale meat in a vending machine either. <laughs> OK, uh, let's try the quiz questions. Number one, why are bears coming into town in Japan? Well, it's said, it's said. Here we go. The bears come into town to find food because there is not enough in the forests. Hmm. OK, and then quiz question two. How much money does Sato get from selling 10 packs of bear meat? 10 packs of bear meat. OK, let's do some, some math. One pack. Uh, he sells seven to ten packs. Yeah, one pack is 2,200 yen. So ten packs is two, uh, <laughs> 22... Thousand yen, yeah, twenty two thousand yen, right, so you could say you could say he gets twenty two thousand yen, right, conversation, please shadow my voice. Have you heard about the new vending machine in town? Yes, I have. It sells bear meat, right. Yeah, apparently it's from the bears they catch in traps around here. I don't know if I could eat bear meat. Well, it's not illegal and they say it's really tasty. I'm not sure I'm brave enough to try it. Uh -huh. Apparently means it seems, it, it seems like, or I have heard... Da, 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 da. Yeah, OK, so let's look at the discussion questions and I'd like you to pause the video and answer them yourself. Number one, would you try bear meat from a vending machine? All right, I think I think I would. I would. <laughs> Number two, what other unusual things have you seen sold in vending machines? <laughs> mm. <laughs> Number three, have you ever had an have you ever had an encounter with a wild animal? So an encounter, a meeting, a meeting. Have you ever met? Have you ever run into <laughs> a wild animal? And number three. What do you think should be done to prevent bear attacks? Prevent, stop, stop bear attacks. Yeah. OK. All right. Thanks very much. I hope you don't have an encounter with a wild bear. Take care out there. <laughs> thanks very much for watching. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye bye.